Welcome to the Pac-12 Cafe and the Sugar Packet Shuffle, where we try to teach you a little bit about the X's and O's in this great game we call football. You've all heard the saying, there's more ways to skin a cat. Well, that's true with football as well. And you've also heard the saying, what is your strength is your weakness. Well, if that's true, then what your weakness is your strength. This last week against California, UCLA had been woeful in pass protection. But instead of necessarily protecting Brett Hundley all the time, they used one of the great weapons against a big time rush, that being the screen pass. Going to show you a couple different ways. The first way, we're going to take Jordan James out of the backfield and motion him out here, which will create an accordion by the Cal linebacker. But we've still got two for two. We're going to throw what we call a quick screen out here, leaving this defender on this running back, you can see the space. You're going to, you like your running back's chances on this particular play. Watch what I'm talking about. Jordan James comes in motion. Right here, Brett Hundley has a zone read op opportunity. He can hand this ball off or he can keep it, but he likes the math outside. He likes the space outside. He's going to give it to his skilled player, Jordan James. He's going to keep the ball right here, whip it out there, puts it in a place where he can make a move. Jordan James makes somebody miss, and the Bruins are off to the races. The second type of running back screen is what we call a slow screen. This time we're going to invite the rush and then the right guard and the center are going to let their blocks go and move out into the field of play so that they can have a kick out block and a seal block, giving the running back an opportunity to make plays after. We're going to get the tackle to invite the outside rush. We're going to let the guard fake the pass rush, he'll release his man. This linebacker is going to blitz. Jake Brendel, the center, is going to let him go. These two will release into the field of play, looking for the first available defender. You're going to see great blocks by Quisenberry and by Brendel, clearing the way. The inside receiver, Devin Fuller, has already taken a linebacker to his eyes to this side of the field, and Eldridge Massington does a great job blocking down the field. This results in a 50-yard touchdown. Huge play in the game right at the end of the first half. Watch the Bruins get the slow screen done. Here you have him. He's, they, they, and, and all these cow guys are saying, hey, 10 sacks they got, Utah got against these guys. Let me go get one. And, and I'll, Hundley invites him to the party and then drops it over the top. You can see Perkins. Look at those great blocks. This is excellent by the big men. Quisenberry lays his guy to the ground. Jake Brendel's going to get his guy to the ground. And Perkins says this is a walk in the park. Down the field go. Massington does a great job. Touchdown UCLA right at the end of the first half. Huge play. When you think about a final score that was 36-34, you know what I'm talking about, how big a play that was. This is the Sugar Packet Shuffle. We, this is where we talk ball. We do it right here at the Pac-12 Cafe. Y'all come back now. You hear?